Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today's video, we're going to be doing a moderation uh, video. So, today's video, I'm going to be teaching y'all how to make a Discord dot pi, um, like moderation bot, I guess. So, this will have a ban command, a kick command, and a purge command. The ban command um, and kick command. And then the purge command will have, like, basically purge command is basically, it will delete a bunch of, a bunch of messages. Uh, by default, if you just do exclamation purge, it will do five messages or it'll delete five messages. And if you just do exclamation purge 10, it will automatically delete 10 messages. So yeah, let's get right into this video. I just want to say this, guys, I do have a life out of YouTube. Please do not be spamming me all over, like, Twitter, Discord, and YouTube. I got someone spamming me on all my social medias asking me, Hey bro, answer your DMs. I have a question about Colorama. Colorama is not working. The whole video is not working. You're bad. And stuff like that. You're not that good at coding. All this type of stuff. I'm like, just because you have an error and I haven't responded in 0.5 seconds, you're just gonna go and like, anyways, just go. I'm gonna teach you guys how you could probably fix it really easily for the uh, color aim, uh, or sorry, for the color aim ear, air for my other video I made. Just do Windows, CMD, PIM, install color aim. All right, you have to install packages. All right. There is no things you have to install inside Visual Studio Code. There's nothing that I have. All right, if that does not work, close out of Visual Studio Code and reopen it. If that does not work, restart your computer. And if that doesn't work, then you have something wrong with your computer. All right, I do not have all day to sit at school and then have to teach you how to do something that you can do in like five minutes or just watch a YouTube video online. All right, if you have any errors, just I just show how to code it. I'm not the errors person. If you have an error with the code itself that says something about the code that's not about the plugins or the packages I'm using, go ahead and DM me. I'll gladly help you because that is something that possibly could happen. So now let's go and fix that or fix the commands or let's do the command now. So let's do at bot dot command. All right. And then we're going to do at has or sorry, commands dot has underscore permissions. Then we're going to do kick underscore members equals true this basically makes it so then if someone doesn't have the permission to kick a member it cannot use this command and we're going to do async def kick 60 comma discord um or sorry member member discord dot member comma star and then we're going to do reason equals none end that off and then we're going to do await member dot kick okay and then we're going to do reason equals reason once you've done that then we're going to do await 60 dot sin okay and we're going to send this message member member has been kicked from the server just like that you can obviously change that if you would like to but I'm not going to be changing it, so let's make sure that it works. Alright. Now, once we've done that, we're going to do exclamation kick, and then we're going to kick my main account, because I'm on my alt. This I do all my stuff on my alt. As you see, I've been kicked, just like that. Now, let's go ahead and invite myself back over. So then we can, so I could show y'all how to do the ban command. Alright, so now let's go and do the ban command. So for the ban command, what you're going to do, hashtag ban command. It's really very similar to the appbot.command, or to the kick command. So, then we're going to do at commands.has underscore permissions. Alright, and then we're going to do ban underscore members. So it's really just, it's just you have to change that for that part. And then we're going to do async def ban. So you also have to change that. Member. Discord. Uh, 
four comma star comma reason equals none. Now we're going to do await member dot kick reason equals reason. Sorry, instead of kick, you change that to ban. All right, just want to go and say this by the way. Um, if you want to change this to a embed, uh, just basically kind of uh, delete the await cxt part and just do um, am equals or embed equals and just create an embed like that. Um, in my part two video, I did teach you on how to make embeds. So if you want to learn how to do that, just go ahead and do that. Now do await cxt.sin. All right, and then we're going to go and just do the same thing. Member has been banned from the server. Just like that. All right, so let's go and restart it. And let's go ahead and try this one out. So exclamation ban, and then we're going to do at pf or yeah. Now to prove that he's actually been banned, that I actually banned myself, we're going to go to ban. And as you see, I've been banned. I'm going to go and revoke the ban, just like that. And yeah, by the way, guys, I will still be making more YouTube videos, all right, and all that. And don't forget, I will be making more Minecraft videos and all that. I just have a life out of YouTube, okay, so I'll still be making videos and all that. Um, and we'll be taking your video requests. I just have to have some time to do it because I have a life, all right. I have to have school, I've, all that stuff. So, yeah, now we're going to make a purge command. So we're gonna do at bot dot command at commands dot has underscore permissions. Okay, and then for this one, we're going to do manage underscore messages. Okay, equals true. So they have to have access to manage messages. Okay, and then we're going to do async def. Okay, and then we're going to do ban, or sorry, not ban, we're going to do purge, okay, and then cxc comma amount equals, and then we're going to change that to five, all right, so we're going to change that one to five now, all right, and that's basically going to be our um, amount like that we would do by default. Now we're going to do await cxc dot channel dot purge, all right, and then we're going to do limit equals amount. Now we're going to do await cxc.sin. All right, this is optional. You don't have to have it, so it sends. But I'm going to, and we're going to do f amount has been removed. Okay, you can obviously change this. Now, if we just run this right here, it would stay there. So to change that, this is also optional. So you could do comma delete after. So this will delete this message after, and we can do five seconds, 5.0, or you could use 4.0, whatever you want. I'm gonna just do five. Okay, and let's go and demonstrate this command. Exclamation purge, purge. It's gonna go and pur purge all those commands. All right, five messages or sorry we need to um, add messages has been removed so let's go and redo this and let's purge and as you see it's obviously been deleted so purge all right and then one two three four five boom just like that automatically delete. I was kind of counting a little too slow. But yeah, um, obviously if you purge 10, it'll automatically start deleting them. It might glitch because you are kind of exceeding the limit of 10 messages and it will go ahead and warn you here saying, as you see, it'll say limit, limit has been reached, but it'll be fine and everything will still be working for you. So yeah, that's how you make it. Uh, the code will be down in the description for the full video and also just the code for just this one. So yeah, hope y'all enjoyed this video. And if y'all did, uh, make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video.